Canada went to Durban in a spirit of goodwill. We went committed to being constructive. We went looking to reach an international climate change agreement that covers all major emitters. As we said from the outset, the Kyoto Protocol does not represent the path forward for Canada. The Durban platform is a way forward that builds on our work at Copenhagen and at Cancun. The Kyoto Protocol, as you know, originally covered countries generating less than 30% of global emissions. Now it covers less than 13%, and that number is only shrinking. The Kyoto Protocol does not cover the world's two largest emitters, the United States and China, and therefore cannot work. It's now clear that Kyoto is not the path forward for a global solution to climate change. If anything, it's an impediment. We are invoking Canada's legal right to formally withdraw from Kyoto. This decision formalizes what we've said since 2006, that we will not implement the Kyoto Protocol. We remain committed to negotiating an international climate change agreement that works. This means getting a pact that involves all major emitters. We will work for this in the coming weeks and months. It will not be easy, but it is important. And Canada will continue to be willing, a willing partner with those looking to address Kyoto's many failings, while also ensuring major emitters live up to binding commitments to reduce greenhouse gases.